Now, it's our top story tonight. Local and federal authorities are investigating after a plane crash in Talbot County earlier today, claiming the life of the pilot. The wreckage discovered about 10 miles outside of Tobleson, which is about 40 minutes northeast of Columbus. Now, officials saying tonight they believe only the pilot was on board when the plane went down. News Center 9's Gabriella Johnson was on scene and has the very latest. I'm standing in the area as close as media is allowed to get on the scene of a plane crash. The crash happened deep into this wooded area where you can see crews had to go through a dense forest to find the crash. One person is confirmed dead, but officials are not sure if anyone else was in the plane because they say the passenger side of the aircraft was completely burned up. Oh, I heard like a big boom. Selena Ellison lives within walking distance of the scene where a small plane crashed around 10 Thursday morning in Talbot County. I thought it was thunder because it was cloudy anyway and, not, and it's supposed to rain. So it was like a big boom and I ain't think nothing, nothing about it. Officials say a Cessna P210 plane like the one you see in this image left Sarasota International Airport in Florida around 8 Thursday morning heading to Thomaston Upson County Airport. According to the Taylor County Sheriff's Office, the Federal Aviation Administration alerted them to the crash. That's when Butler Municipal Airport Manager Cody Rustin was called in to help with the search. He spotted the aircraft in a remote rural area. It was sort of just straight down in the woods, so it didn't leave a big path going in. So it was not, not really obvious to We got sort of on top of it and we could find it. Rustin says every plane has an emergency locator transmitter and is used in cases like this. And I was trying to monitor that, but it had, it, it was not working, so that didn't help us any. It was just, it was just, uh, just flying and looking. It, it was no, no special equipment to, to find it other than just looking. Rustin and a partner found the Cessna in Talbot County off of Poplar Trace. Nearly five hours after the crash, a Talbot County ambulance came on the scene to remove the body. Talbot County Sheriff Sheriff Johnson says he will give an update Friday morning in regards to the pilot's identity as well as any more information with this investigation. Along with Talbot County Sheriff, the FAA and the National Transportation Safety Board is on this investigation. Reporting in Talbot County, Gabriella Johnson for News Leader 9.